In the middle of this Abrua land stood a leafless and lifeless tree. Perhaps the only tree that has survived the third world war. A war that saw the gradual rooting of the land. A war that left a nation with nothing but the large tree standing. This tree bled and cried. It's bled and cried with an agony that leaves with just a single man. It's much of a dispensation where wounds are viewed as mere wounds, but a non existent trees are cherished. the number of furniture in the universe and you know the number of countries over the centuries. You take you the visa and via venture and such. There you can trace their genesis from where they come from, whether from the Spanish of the the foreign zones, or from the poor country. Move your curiosity a bit further so you can add infinitum acts to their full names. Full names of the furniture you buy, whether the legal mountains, the legal sapphire, or the power of Chainsaws are messily cutting from every direction to replace every place to be But never is it funny. We are replacing our food. As soon when we decide to ride the sun to the bed, then we will see nothing but every man can jump off the shore to the world. So back to the dream that speaks answers to these issues, back to the revelation. And now, should the Lord open its toothless mouth for sharpening its blood for? Should the sign of the bond of 1844 be abated at the glass shoot? Or should the martial law of Kaga Mujiri be killed in your life so you pay with your life be achieved? Question that you may not answer. The martial law of Kaga Mujiri. The law has it. Let's be protected. Our fancy chief, despite their poor cause, have sold their shorts to this world and just to have a shirt. That which protects that we have, standing in the dream of civilization. It's a dream that only the can take care of our country and we can find. Nevertheless, this dream will be the possibility of four shadows.